system. Hey, how's it going? We're headed in on our annual fishing trip. Had to work all day, I'm off the rest of the week, so closed up shop and heading in to meet dad. You know, I do want to say I'm pretty fortunate. My father's retired. He goes in ahead of me and sets everything up. So I'm kind of spoiled. I'll get there and he'll have the tent set up. You know, a lot of times he has dinner already cooked, so all I have to do is unload my stuff and everything's good, set to go. So. So I'm kind of spoiled in that sense. Uh, or you can say I'm pretty fortunate. Hopefully the weather's good. Hopefully the fishing will be good. But hey, if the fishing's not good, hey, whatever. It'll be a good good time nonetheless. It's good to just kind of get away and unwind. And, and uh, doing these trips, you know, it's a good way to hit reset. Kind of get back in tune with things. Uh, you know, kind of the way life should be. So stay tuned. So what do we get good? I'm gonna take a look. Yeah. We have, and maybe just about done, Paul. What do you think? It looks good. Huh? Looks real good. My truck's all dirty. Huh? So my truck's all dirty. Yeah, mine's all scratched up. I hit a tree again, coming in. How the heck did you hit a tree? On the other side. <laughs> Don't mm. ask. I have no idea, but I did. It was hanging out in the road, and I thought I went out far enough around it on the Jack Mountain Road there. I guess we'll right down the side of unload. The Here's a nice little northern Maine pond, right full of native brook trout. So there's a lot of showers coming through right now. I think we're gonna eat supper and finish setting up camp. All that good stuff. And then uh, I think we get a big day planned for tomorrow. Probably Fisher Pond first thing in the morning. Not sure if tomorrow we're gonna head down to a few streams, wade those. We've gotten a lot of rain the past week, week and a half. So I'm not sure what the water flow is gonna be like there, but we'll, We'll fish a few streams during the day and then hit some good ponds at night and I think we're going to have good fishing. So, Dad's yeah, just finishing up the pizza right now. Skies have kind of cleared. It's going to be a good time. It's going to be our home for the next few days. Better get my stuff moved in. Dad's all set up. Start calling him Sally. So Dutch oven pizza, huh? I don't know if that's just about perfect right there. Looking pretty good. Yeah, green peppers, onions, and mushrooms. About as that good looks as... Like, that looks like a deep dish pizza. That's about as good as I can do it right there, Paul. Sweet pea still sleeping. Doesn't get much prettier than that. It's five o'clock in the morning. I think it's coffee time. Good, good morning, sunshine.
get some of mom's delicious homemade bread, huh? Coffee mug. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Breakfast time. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? No, it's good. Looks good. So we're just gonna go try out front here for a minute. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Just finished breakfast. Go out and see if we can catch some fish right out front here. Not much for breeze today, so. Nice morning. Beautiful morning. Yeah, it really couldn't be any better. They don't get much better. That took long enough. Right where you told me to. That's a nice trout. Pretty little fat guy. It is. Pinched the barb with my hook, it came right out easy. That was a bit of a slow morning. Yep. I guess it's snack time. Or for some of us, nap time. Snack and nap. So it's all for the evening fishing. Huh? Yep. Yep. Headed out with high expectations. And good weather. We get some wood detail right now, don't we? Yep. Looking for an old piece of dead hardwood for campfire. Standing dead timber makes the best firewood especially when you've had as much rain as we've had. This is this evening's fishing. Weather's good anyway. We'll see how the fishing is. Let's go check on the canoe. Canoe looks good? Yep. It's a combination. <laughs> <laughs> uh, whatever you told me it was. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Awful nice evening. Beautiful evening. I think it's a beautiful evening. I think if we can't catch a fish tonight, then... Uh, Something's wrong. Something's wrong. That's a good fish ball. That's not a bad fish ball. Another one. How big is it? Six, seven pounds. <laughs> yeah. I'm letting, I'm letting you thin out all the small ones. Nice. Get a little salad to go with it. Yeah, a little salad. Yeah, 
Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Foot long. Yep. Yeah, it feels like a pole. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Right in the shallows too, Paul. When you're pretty in this clear water. Yeah. Beautiful trout. Okay. Yeah. Probably 13 or so, Paul. Yeah. Nice one, dude. Oh, that one, dude. Yeah, beautiful. Nice one. Pretty fish. That's a nice one, dude. Yeah, it is. I nice said, you know. I should have held him up. There he goes, off into the deep. Oh, I missed him. Well, we'll take... Yeah, you bad. almost kind of have to... Uh... They are... The water's clear and the fish are being selective. So it was a good night fishing. Yep, very good night. Didn't get uh, quite as many fish as we wanted, but yeah, we caught some nice fish and we caught fish. The, the fish, yeah. were, they, they were selective. Yeah, they were tough to catch. There was no question about it. So I guess to close it all out, we're having deer steak, roasted red peppers, and fiddleheads. Yeah. He's right there. He keeps coming closer and closer. He is. I didn't realize I was such an owl. Yeah, I'll call you the owl whisperer. Oh, he's right there. Oh my goodness. Yeah. You called him in. I did. Oh, that is awesome. Yeah, the gig is up, buddy. He's like, I've had enough. I'll call you the owl whisperer. The owl whisperer.